With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is, consider an atom with atomic number Z as consisting of a positive point charge at the center and surrounded by a distribution of negative electricity uniformly distributed within a sphere of radius R. The electric field at a point inside the atom at a distance small r from the center is. So we can say here, suppose this is our, let's say here, nucleus of the atom whereby positive point charge is, let's say here, located and here in the remaining space of the atom negative charge is uniformly distributed within the sphere of radius r. So, we can say here for an atom of here XAZ, we have here XAZ means we can say here number of proton and number of electron is equal to Z. Hence, we can say here the proton located at the center of this atom at the nucleus is plus ZE and here negative charge is distributed throughout the volume of this let's say atom where we can say here of radius given as let's say capital R. Now we can say here this negative charge is distributed throughout the volume of this let's say atom. Now we need to find electric field inside the atom at distance R from the center. So we use here Gauss law. So to find electric field at point P we assume an imaginary Gaussian surface of radius small r. So, applying Gauss law, we have here net electric flux given as surface integral of electric field, which here is equal to, we can say as Q enclosed divided by, we can say as epsilon naught. So, here we can say this area vector is, let's say, repulsive outwards and since here positive charge is more than negative charge hence electric field is also outwards both radially outwards hence E and area vector make an angle of 0 degree with each other therefore E dot ds here becomes our E ds cos of 0 degree is equal to here Q enclosed let's say plus Z E at the center and we can say here the minus charge within small radius r. So, this can be found out by using volume charge density that is minus ZD charge is distributed within 4 by 3 pi into capital R cube. So, in 4 by 3 into pi into small r cube volume, the charge is equal to minus ZE into we have here as r cube divided by capital R cube so, here substituting the value, we have here negative charge equal to minus of we can say as ZE into we have here as R cube divided by capital R cube divided by in the denominator we have here as epsilon naught. Now, here electric field is uniform throughout this Gaussian surface. So, E comes outside. So, this becomes E surface integral of area vector Z comes common. So, Z by epsilon naught into 1 minus R cube divided by capital R cube. Now, we can say here this comes out to be our integration of let's say area vector of Gaussian surface is 4 pi small r square equal to Z e by epsilon naught into we have here as 1 minus R cube divided by capital R cube. So, this becomes our E is equal to we have here as Z E divided by in the denominator there is 4 pi epsilon naught into R square into 1 minus R cube divided by capital R cube. So, we can say here taking R square to inside hence this result comes out to be electric field as we have here Z E divided by 4 pi epsilon naught into we can say here as 1 upon r square minus here this comes as r divided by r cube. Now amongst the four options we can see here option number one is the correct answer hence we can say one is our answer. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.